Mid game. I think I want to put delinquent back in. Zara Rock. Oh yeah. I think I want to put. Seb said it won him four games that he wouldn't have otherwise won, Joe. Yeah, that's true. I like winning games. Oh, don't you dare get N off of order pad for random receiver. Please. Buzzer up waiting room. It's a long wait, if that's what you're waiting for. Double heads on the order pad this turn. Okay. Turns out I am going to be fuming this game. Oh my god. What?! Okay, the stream's over. Bye. Oh, yes. Oh, he's actually gone. He's actually gone. That's incredible. He's walking and everything. His legs... He's so angry, his legs fixed. He's gone. He's gone. Joe. Joe. Ah! <laughs> Joe! Joe, come back! Joe! No, oh, it's 12, 11, 10. Ah! He's not going to make it. He's not going to make it. Time to take over? It might be. Ah, Joe, you even promoted the wrong Pokemon. That was good, wasn't it? Ooh. Did you see what happened? I caught the end of it. I caught the end of him getting a beast ring. Giving you the ring sting. Three card hand. Yeah. Classic style. Board of bad heads. Into yeah. random receiver, into N. Yeah, yeah, okay, 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 I'm listening. Into order pad heads, B string. Yeah. Already had the other B string Boswell from the four card N for himself. Oh, yeah. That's, that's not bad, that is. That is not bad. First game. <laughs> if, if, it, <laughs> if I hadn't mentioned that before, first game. Jeez, Jack, I mean, I mean that's Beast Box's name, Ringsting. I don't know what you're on about, Nick. We patented that name from day one. Happy Freedom Day, boys. Go celebrate more freedom. Joe's opponents have free reign to do what they wanted there. Pretty broken. That's just not right. It's just not right. So many situations I can be like, okay, I can deal with that. Okay, got the end. Okay. There's only a four card hand. All he has to do is not get a fully powered up Buzzwell from a board of just Garbador. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That reminds me of something similar to what I did to you. That's a joke. Oh, this is going to be a good stream. We're going to be without our European friends today as well, because they're all flying. They're all in the air. Well, I assume they are. I... Yeah, I would assume so. I'm playing against Magnazone, and I think it's going to win. Another three hours. Yeah, that's gonna be the the difficult thing here, isn't it? I mean, I could just go. I could go Lele, grab the Bridget now, and then puzzle afterwards. I guess that's probably best, rather than just get a Zerua. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll go Lele, grab Bridget to hand, then puzzle. Oh, 
Mark's being beetled by TSA. Okay, so we'll do it this way round. We bridge it, pass. Then we top deck this, discard these two cards for a third layer that's going onto this board. Sounds excellent. Couldn't be happier. I'm going to lose to Magnazone, Joe. Because he did a similar similar turn to what you just had. I've just realised something. Yeah, yeah, just realised something. What have you realised? Should have put that ultra ball definitely to the top because we're actually not going to draw that ultra ball now. Oh dear. Oh. It's fine. We couldn't win with three Lele's on our board. We need the space, lads. We just gotta get Luki. This Lele's not going down for like two turns anyway. We can just start swinging. If he tries to float Rockcraft, that would be really good. So we can actually get use out of Goose. Make it look like we actually have a hand when we don't really. We want to have a convincing Guzma turn next turn, so he doesn't know that we're dead drawing. That's the that's the plan. Damn. Poggers. Going for the Diancy strong turn. Greed. That's so greedy. Get out of my life. So 40 is bad everywhere, right? This already has 60. I guess we still pull up the Lycan Rock. Max Finch, good evening. May I have more UK Cup sooner rather than later? Tell me more. Hello? England won you a hundred bucks, Poggers. Do you say we win on pens? Should have got better odds if that was the case. Oh my god. Just hard had it. Just absolutely had it. Oh my goodness me, this guy didn't GX me. Wow. Wow. Okay. Not really in a talking mood now. <laughs> it's a shame I've got three hours here. Why does this guy well played in me? I've already faced Sylvia on the ladder twice today with Zoripod. Really? Yeah. How long have you been playing? Uh, since six. Oh, double tails. That's no good. I need to bench this Lele. TPI said places can start hosting cups from the 9th of July. Whoa, that's crazy. I like it. Wait for next season? Yeah. Whoa. That means we're playing Pokemon again soon, Joe. Oh, that no. That sucks. That sucks real hard. Oh, I don't, don't want to play Pokemon. Nuts. Have you not seen the Nuzlocke we've been playing? That's VG. We're in the VG tournaments. Tell me that. Oh, Poggers. This E Hammer's not very good in the Magnazone matchup. I tell you oh, that. Oh, Spanking Fob. That's amazing. Congrats, dude. 
Hey! That's the climb right there. Anyone can do it. No reason why you couldn't. Well done. Deserve it, dude. So after this year's uh, stuff, for, like we've still got to hear it. They said at the end it will be the end of July where we hear the tournament structure or the CP structure. Mm -hmm. um, but I would personally like to have my invite by Christmas this year. That'll be a month earlier than I had it this year, or like this season. Which is see what what do I say? Do I say this season or last season? Because in about three weeks, well, in about a week's time, we're going to be playing say for this next season. season. You say this season, and you're playing for next season. Okay, so yeah, this season I got my invite in January. Um, next season I want to have it by December. Forever growing. <laughs> Why am I going to lose to a Bulbasaur deck? <laughs> I'm trapped in a glass case of emotion. Damn it. When was Bremen? September. So I had it in September. No. We. Oui. No. I had it pretty early though. Anaheim Open. Anaheim Open, Bremen. Bremen. Two months ago. Liverpool. Did you have it before? I think Liverpool was the weekend I got it. That was bit before Bremen. Ah, well then. <laughs> Did you get it just off one season of Cubs? Was it before London? Yeah. Okay. So um, I was in, I was in top uh, top sixteen in London. So you've got to aim for it. I was top twenty two in London. So I guess if you can't work out the exact date, you well you could work out the exact. Date, but I guess your uh, aim is quarter one again. Yeah. Sure. Good I'll, aim. I'll be playing in another open. So. Well, that's the thing. You've got Valencia, which is a regional points-wise, we think. That'll be that's an interesting question actually. Do you think what what do you think they'll do with the tournament with the point structure? Because we don't know whether why are you ninja boying? Ha ha ha! Sorry, I've just been ninja boyed. Um. I didn't realise that was in format. <laughs> How? That has been non-existent for so long. Yeah, and now I lose. Welcome to the lower tables. Um, yeah, do you think they'll still run it with points from this year? Or do you think they'll just not give out CP and they'll just store the winner's data until the structure's announced? I have no idea. Because it's a weird one. Okay, the perfect draw. Remember us putting that to the top? We're wizards of this game. Wizards of the... But yeah, my point being, you've got Valencia, the Open, and Frankfurt Regionals before when we would assume EUIC is. So yeah. you've got three Regionals plus two cut wins, potentially. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty I reasonable. I think it's definitely doable for you. How do I deal 210 damage to an Acrosma in one turn? What are you playing? Zoro Rock. And I've used my GX attack. Well, then. You're right, it's going to be difficult. Is there anything I can cop copy with cop. new? Cop. Pop. cop out. Is there anything I can copy with new? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ah, I'm 20 damage short with a Mew energy drive. Damn it. They went, enemy. they went first and chose to put that on their bench. That's a big no-no. Hmm. 
Me forty, sixty, eighty, one hundred and twenty, one forty, one seventy. Yeah, there's no way I can do it. Oh, well played, Magnezoin man. Wrecked. Wrecked by my own deck. Actually, there's no Zoroark in this one, and there was no Dialga, so he's not even playing it right. Just climbing ELO today. I was streaking for a few games today, then I hit double Sylveon. Uh, I just lost to that Buzzgarb, which played expertly. Did you even play out the Sylveons, or did you see the Mons? And... I waited till Hooper came down in both in both games. Yeah. I was like, oh, okay, I'll end him out. End him. Yeah. End turn one, end turn two. And they just got potions and nest balls, so well played. Got themselves into the game. Cheeky beggars. <sighs> oh, I think I found a Malamar. Ultramar. I played Buzzrock one game and faced Espion Garb as well, so that's good. Skylar? What's this card do? Two energy and a discard pile. If we let him have a wimp, we are... A wimp. Not able to get grass energy to respond on him, but this gives us three Zarawaks looking at our hand. Giving him Lele sounds really bad. Okay. Let's just hit DC. Hopefully with three Zarawaks we can hit a DC plus Cynthia. Should be fine. Prepare to see a green boy. Who knows, maybe they don't have floatstone. Maybe they have to Guzma to be safe. Oh, Jack's gone somewhere. <laughs> Ultra squiddly diddlies. Here's a hard matchup. Jack had a power cut. For real. Oh, the play Guru. I have no chance. We lost. Rip. There's the Squidums. They're not powering up a Dawnwings, are they? What are you doing? What? Why? You need that in the bin for... Uh... Okay. Okay. Doing the Evo setter first because we want to draw into energy rather than uh, Zoroark. If he's powering up this guy and he needs the Dawn Wings to move the active, we should actually do this. Either we get rid of the Guru, which is great for us, or this going is actually fine for us as well. It still hurts his path for next turn. And it stops him playing them against us. Why is there Dormings on their bench? They actually chose to lead it against us. Well, they were going first. They chose to lead Inke plus Dormings. 
if you go first, you only need to put down one. You only need to put down an active Pokemon. You never need to play down another one. They just chose to. Uh, I don't really want to Ultra Ball away Goose and Puzzle. They sound too good. Let's just hope off this Cynthia we can hit Energy, not Grass. Okay. Two, four, six, eight. We still have a trade. Do we? No. Excellent. Oh yeah, I was thinking about the third one coming down. Um, I want the Lele for damage. Two, four, six, eight. Eight plus one, ten. Uh, maybe we don't need to. Let's be flexible. Let's see how they get out of this conundrum. They have a large hand size. They can probably KO this Sarawak. If they have a slightly weaker turn, maybe it's a Guzmron Zerua. Or Guzmron Lele. We'll see. They have Ultra Ball. They're up to something. Okay, it looks like they're getting an out another Dawn Wings just to bin, it looks like. So they have Sycamore. Oh, they're doing it to improve their Elixir odds, that's fine. Elixirs and Letters in this list, hello. Hmm. Still hit, so... Excellent play. I think the elixirs might actually help you against Buzzrock. Like the B strings help you much more against Zoroark. Elixirs help you much more against Buzz. Because they're hoping to burst out one of these against Buzz, really. Chelsky, how's it going? Can I not move? Oh, they can. They can. Okay. Just had space. Oh, we hit all the DCs we ever wanted, so that's chill. Uh, as much as I want to end them... This is just better, right? Please tell me I have the Pokemon. Okay, we do. Trader Ruski. I think I'm going to get rid of DC here, but I really don't know. Uh, okay. I need to draw more cards. I want to try and establish another Zoroark and have an N for next turn. Well, that can do one of those things. Hmm. I think we're just killing this, though. Let's see if they play like B-strings and stuff, <laughs> as well as Elixir. So Panic, how's it going? There was an opinionated Greninja player in chat on Monday. I believe some of those, were opi those opinions popped up in hell today. In some, he was PMing someone. <laughs> <laughs> Did I watch the game last night? Of course, Chelsky, of course. I almost leapt out of my seat. Almost. For penalties. It was excruciating. Zoro Pog? Asked Sean. Yeah, it's just me saying Poggers. It's Zoro Pod, though.
Max running down the 60th card for Ultra Squidums. Uh, I think Tina still. Bloody Frog's still around. Opinions on Colombian's tactics and Diego Maradona's comments. Both trash. Oh my god, he does have space. What is happening today? <laughs> what is wrong with this week? This week is ridiculous. And the float stone, by the way. Disgusting. That term is actually just filth. Will we top deck N? Is it better for me to attack with Glissopod? for 80 here, because of stadium. Um, and combine that with an N. Or is it better? No, no, we have to. Yeah, we do have to. Have to armor press this boy. We lose to Goose currently because we have two things that we can't evolve. We could draw into both those things and feel silly about benching this other Zerua, but I feel like we're gonna need it. We're gonna need some turns of freedom to win this game, so. Let's see if they can't high roll me again. Oh, he has GX. Okay, he already had game because of GX. Yeah, I forgot about that anyway. Okay, so benching Azura was always wrong. <laughs> Just throw that out there. Yeah, I forgot that has other attacks. I forgot that many prizes have been taken, to be honest. So was N ever right there? We still had to end him that turn. I couldn't GX his Dawn Wings, so there was no point in Goose Ring. That done good GX attack. I mean, we couldn't play around it from the hand that we drew. It would have been a mega lull if I had found the other Zoroark and then benched myself for game loss. But let's just forget that. I try playing Zoragadi. I don't think that's going to be a useful. Uh, it's just not a worthwhile use of time, to be honest. Oh, I really can't be bothered for spread nonsense. Can you just go away?
where's the buzz rock? <sighs> kind of want to attach. Yeah, we will attach. Okay. I was thinking only real concern is energy drive. Will Bosrock die after rotation? No. Strong energy goes, but the rest of the stuff doesn't. Well, artillery does go actually. Maybe, maybe that was too quick of me. I don't know, everything's different. I can't really give you a for sure answer. That was too lazy of me just to say no outright. I'll oh, play around that po town. Get wrecked. We don't want him to have the monkey. Mm, what's our turn next turn? We'll figure it out. When should we expect uh, post rotation content? Yeah, post worlds, post worlds. Elixir's also go. Yeah, okay, you're right, you're right. It does lose a lot. Will I play some Mali today? Possibly. I don't know, I've already, I already am in a defeatist mood today. Uh, because of some uh, earlier shenanigans. Well, well, mad captain. Good God. Who are you people? This could be good for us uh, to remove damage stuff, but for now. Just gonna do the thing and the stuff and the why parallel if it weakens this was output. Uh, I was actually thinking the other way around, removing our damage stuff later on, but that's way down line. Like if he's going for a. Uh... If he's going for the turn, you know, like the devolve turn or the lele turn, we can uh, just like bench extra stuff, remove our two leles. That will probably be what we end up doing. We just need to get a decent hand, which is hard because we only have one Zoro. But we'll see. Choice ban means we probably have to try and GX this bad boy.
only real concern is that they can play uh, Fury Belts as well. There's the Lele. Nine, ten, eleven, fifteen. They're at two ten right now. do also play Acerola as well. Uh, I think I'd rather get rid of the Evo Soda here. Sycamore's not N, so we're pretty happy with that. Yeah, we were fairly lucky to hit a DCE, but... Another counter energy going. They play special charges though, right? They play like at least one. Sometimes it's double charge. Which that's fine. Yeah, it's absolutely fine. Decision. Is it better to deal with this Coco now? They have 190... 230, 290 damage. And a Devolve at any time. We need to get at least another Zerua down because of Devolve wrecking us. We could... Okay. We could just Mallow Float and a Supporter for next turn. That's not Guzma. Alternative is to just if we just Guzma this now, like, hold on, this is his last, no, this is his second last counter energy. I think we're mallowing. Basically just so that we get a support of the next turn. If he gets a, uh, an Espeon down, or if he wants to use his Lele. DC off into four with 30 cards in the deck. I mean, we had three copies and we had a trade. So it was six cards, not four cards, but still. There, it wasn't. It wasn't like guaranteed by any means. And there's the minuscule puzzle outs as well. Well, it's not an Espeon turn. And it's not a Lele turn. It is more damage though. Another counter catcher. Another Lele. Okay. Flying flip.
this can be our uh, our parallel turn, right? Yep. Definitely our parallel turn. We'll be removing a lot of damage. I think I'll trade first. Just in case we can get our blower, so I don't have to puzzle for it. Do I need to blow her? 130, 230, 280. 280 is not scary. So we should get this and probably just DC or probably Guzma, right? Guzma so we can just attack again with the pod. Yeah. Wait, we have Goo no, we don't have Goose in hand. It's definitely Stadium. I think Goose is safest. I actually should have done all this first. If I, if I decided that I wasn't uh, field blowering, I should have done this first. I might still need Pokemon for the Rash's beating to finish something off here, but. Now this one's always going and it's just whether or not I get rid of my other. So 280. I still want to draw more cards to just secure the game. Do I think this version is better than what Magnus played for the NAIC? This version of Zoropod? I don't remember what his list was for the NAIC. That was 30 unnecessary damage. Oh, you're right, you're right, it was. Yeah, that was just missequenced. If we don't get end, end, we win though. Never punished. Yeah, there shouldn't be 30 on this guy. I missequenced parallel. I knew I had to retreat first. <laughs> Miro K1, cheers for the follow. This basically guarantees that he loses though by removing all the damage he's spent this turn. Like the whole game, I mean. Two big old prize cards. Uh, just because of misclick potential, <laughs> I guess we'll do it. Oh, Magnus Sheffield list. Do I think my build's better? Um, I don't know. I, I like my build. I, I am playing for Guzma over Countercatcher right now, which is like probably the biggest debatable card. Basically, I've because the game plan against Buzzrock is actually to get Mew down really early, just slaying their baby Buzzwalls, you actually go behind a lot less than I thought. So the Countercatcher has been really niche. So I'm just going back to fourth Goose because it's, so important for like Malamar and stuff. So 
I think my list is pretty straightforward. I think Tui Hammer is pretty important as well now for the amount of Zorin Mirrors coming back in. Um, Magnus played three parallel, which is pretty insane, I would say. He made a lot of correct decisions, but I think the three parallel may not have been one of them. You said, I said I had to play Countercatcher last week. Yeah, but you don't have to, <laughs> right? <laughs> I don't know. I, I thought you had to. And then I thought Guzma was actually just a really good card. Hmm. Like, basically every game I've played with Pod, puzzling Guzma is what you're doing. So... I figured having four... Like, probably what should be correct is playing four Guzma and counter-catcher. Not, not cutting a Guzma for a catcher. Realistically, it could be a Evo Soda that gets cut. Um, that's probably fine. It's probably correct. But I've drawn so poorly that I'll stick with three sodas. I don't know. We'll hopefully face some buzz rocks today and see the spots where we're like, what if I had counter catcher here? One of the benefits of counter catcher though is that we do play double mallow now, so it makes it like a Guzma plus one kind of thing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Get her out of here. My cat's just caught a mouse. <laughs> That's ridiculous. And my mum's trying to not make noise. <laughs> so she's panicking. <laughs> oh dear. Mirror? Not mirror. Cheers for the zits, uh, the zits, the bits, Zoro Mano 5. Thanks so much, dude. Go on, wimp out. Oh, it's got an ultra ball first. What is Pooperson? That's the name of my cat. <laughs> Captain, why? Why? How's that even happened? <laughs> Deary me. Who needs Zora Walks? Right. Juicy turn one from them. Shiny liquid metal slime. Okay, I see where you've been uh, lured in. I understand. Now their hand size is two, and you'd like to think when they have a Wimpod Trubbish start, they wouldn't lay lay Bridget greedily. That's what you'd like to think, so I won't spend the puzzle here. Oftentimes against Garb decks, you don't get the full benefit of four actual puzzles, so there was some debate to just throwing it out there. Yeah, he had Sycamore. It's fine. It's fine. Crabcore 3, cheers for the follow. Ooh, they play rainbows? That's good for us. Oh, of course they play rainbows, what am I saying? But them having to put down a rainbow is good for us. 
Ooh, a second puzzle. Are they in? They're in. They're behind me. Okay. Let's draw some cards. Well, we have four draws to hit an energy. We need a float stone if we don't hit the DCE. Uh, it's probably best if we try and get a third Zoroark out, I guess. So we'll do it in this order. The hammer's really nice. Do I want to play a Lele pre trade? Because it can. Uh, yeah, yeah. Because we could get Beerled by a Floatstone. So we probably want to support her. It isn't Mallow. And we're always trading away this Mew because it's terrible. Yep, yeah, see you later. Hmm. Wrap Scallion. No free damage for us. Oh well. Maybe it forces them to put a Floatstone on a non Garbodor target, which is also pretty good for us. get a full-up boxes in Brazil. Oh, that's pretty, pretty grim. All right, here comes the pod. Surprised he actually didn't evolve this one because this one's always a Cerola Ribble. Maybe he'll evolve this one. No? Yeah, that's really weird. But they're drawing pretty reasonably, well, pretty well, to be honest. Like, that's a good turn too. Couldn't get active, but still pretty good. No tool is good for us. What's our ideal turn? Fuse with a garb, right? That's ideal. Feels bad, man, that we had to play that Lele, expecting him to do the right thing. Oh well. Let's do one trade, see what we get off this. Well, that is dealing with Garbador. So I'll trade once more. Ah, that's much easier. How many items are we looking at? Yeah, we're completely fine. Come here. I like drawing cards. Don't forget it. to get the Charizard full up boxes though. <laughs> Baby rage. No! <laughs> it's not the same. It's just not the same. Where is old? I wonder what's happened to him. I'm lonely.
It's got a power cut that lasts until 10. How do you know these things? You're a wizard. Was it a scheduled thing? Deal with the annoying bits first. <laughs> Dark spending path. Should I put some music on then? Let's put some music on. Let me know how that volume is like. Should be okay. I don't know. We'll we'll find out. Vod might get taken down. Uh, I I probably won't even upload this. You know. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. I need something to get me through, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Rip YouTube, yeah. Feels super weird to mallow for a uh, Acer Rider for next turn. Yeah, that's what we should do though. So, uh, maybe not the puzzle, maybe just DC. Because if we do it like this, he can't end away our Acerola coming up because they have to Acerola themselves, probably. Really hope someone rips the audio to steal the song. Tech cute. Yeah, the ratings are pretty interesting. I've got the averages now. Or well, not the averages, the um, most frequently answered rating for each card. So I need to add that into the slides tomorrow and then we'll record it after that. So that should be fun. I think it's a pretty cool feature just to have some reference, like us rating higher or lower than, you know, the average, I guess you could say, player. The more people who answer, the better though. So hopefully it's one of those things that if it works out this time, it'll just grow.
some people just troll by answering five for everything. There wasn't that much of that actually. I was surprised. But I think because it actually takes physically so long, people don't or people didn't do that in this case. Two, four, six, eight, ten. 12, 14, 16. Unreal. We can turn the music off. Amazing. Hello? Hi there. You're back. I'm back. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. What's happened? Loads, mate. Tim told me he got high rolled. Which Fine. game? <laughs> Malamar went with 100 energy cards. Yes. They played, um, they played Letters, Elixirs, and um, B-Strings. Just up the space, mate. They did. Um, well, I lost a game because of that, so I'm quite annoyed. It was against, it was against Malamar, so I reckon I had a good, good chance. But okay, fine. Yeah. What happens? You did hit the last pole, but not this, not this time. Oh boy, I think I'm getting zero pod. We just have to Should have faith in the community. That's the that's the little catch twenty two here, with our little faith in the community. Our little thought experiment. Joe, oh. you pog pog. <laughs> zero pog. Indeed, I'm against Sorry, Pod, and I have to discard two energy turn one. Ha ha ha! That's good, isn't it? Trust Verbank, Joe. Hmm. About that. We've got some questions. You're against Golly Garb. Hello? I am. Um... We need puzzles. Galisopod Garboda. None of those I are puzzles. Really don't want to have to use double puzzle turn two just for a supporter. That would be unfortunate. Oh wait, I can't play puzzles because of item usage, right? Oh no, we're killing the trubbish this turn. Two, four, six. Okay, yeah, so that's fine. We can play cards that we don't need. <laughs> and in an ideal world, we get double puzzle off this. <laughs> da, 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 da. Not quite. Hey, Fonte is increasingly becoming Verbank. And then they'll create a new group, and that'll become Hey Fonte and Verbank, and the cycle will repeat. We must break the cycle. Let's just pray for no choice Bandarunio, Guzmarunio, then, I guess. All three of our ends are in the discard pile, so we needed puzzles to affect his hand. He promoted that guy, though, so that's good. <clears throat> they could still do it the other way around though. They could still just energy the Lele or floatstone the Lele plus Guzma. Okay. They didn't have it, everyone. Everyone, come quick. Get digging. How many Guzmas have they actually played? I feel, I feel like they played a lot. Oh, they didn't play two. Okay. 
Cheers, game, for not being a pog pog all your life. Oh, oh Joe, I don't like Zoroark. Why not? I don't like Zoro Rock. Because it plays timer balls over Evo Surgers. True. And I just, I just, like, I just don't want to flip the coin, so I just discard it. Excellent. And then. I lose. Yes, I am multi switching to a Lele and swinging with a Lele this turn. You're right. Keep them guessing. Keep them guessing. Always keep Cheers them on their toes. The... Cheers to the host, as all. Uh, not as all. Rahul. It's just. Uh... I don't know. Like, I have not. It's so difficult because I don't know whether I'm. I feel so inexperienced with Zora. I don't know whether, like, I should have just flipped the coins and hoped for double heads. But that never feels right. That just never feels right. My turn. My turn is great if I hit double heads, but I go for the safe play of getting a supporter and get punished. Lieutenant Surge cheering a hundred bits. Thanks so much. Ah, oh, that's Thanks, Surge. Awesome. I think we'll do the same play of going Lele Bridget now, then do single puzzle. Although we do have the Ultra Ball. Hmm. Hmm. Just Ultra Ball. Save the puzzle for later, mate. Nah, puzzle. You don't know how to Zoroark. I apparently don't. Because I'm losing again. I also would puzzle in that situation. He says. <clears throat> I did it earlier. It's fine. I actually don't think I had an ultra ball there. But your hand's pretty awkward. Tech Q. I didn't have Lele in the deck. Did I? I thought I didn't have uh, Lele in the deck. Tech Q. Did I take it off my last... Did I take it off a prize? If so, then we had guaranteed game. I was only trading it because I thought I didn't have Lele's to play. I thought I played my last one the turn prior. Or, sorry, traded it the turn prior. I don't know. When I play PTCGO, I don't keep track of prizes, and I need to look at discard piles more and stuff. It's part of the reason why I'm losing more games, just because I'm sort of going through the motions a lot at the moment, rather than actually like thinking too hard about everything I do. Oh, brilliant! He parallels me. Uh, I'm not. No, I can't. I can't do this, Joe. I what? need buzz rock. I need. A, I need. I need a buzz wall in my life. Okay. This requires way too much thinking. Why can't I just see what is his hand? Ah! <laughs> Whoa! Don't you dare! Don't you put that card down! Don't you do it, you little scamp! <laughs> what have you done? You've doomed us all, and you've attached to it as well, have you? Jack, you want to not think, play Greninja? Buy my chinny chin chin. I did say I wanted to play Greninja one more time this season. Huh? <laughs> Sorry, did you say something? I said nothing, Joe. Don't you worry. I suggested cutting your Tina promo. <laughs> Just, you know. 
Ninja's not anywhere, mate. It's not in the top three. Not going to see you play. Just cut it. See you in the final. <laughs> Give me those mulligans, please. And there's a puffer. That's the hand of Sycamore, right? Because they were using all those mysterious treasures hands. like No Man's Land. Oh, the hand was last treasure? Okay. Treasure. No, we're not going to any, I see. That is what you are. Yeah, uh, we're not going. I do need therapy. I need some Zorok therapy. I was actually... You've just Mark. gone over the whole circle in a, in a space of five seconds. Five minutes. Well, I know I know for a fact Zorak is the most rewarding play if I do well with it. If I can do well. If I can play a deck well. So mm -hmm. I shouldn't aim to play a mindless deck and just do fine. I should try and improve by playing a good deck. And learn it. Yeah, I was genuinely talking to Mark today about uh, coaching. Yeah. But I think he's going to not let me play Zoroark. So, I need a Zoroark coach. Forget that guy. The name Jack is close to Jake. <laughs> Coincidence, I think not. See, this is uh, the where we need counter catcher right now. If you do, like, they're definitely GX attacking this turn. And we need counter catcher in our lives. We do have two Zoroarks to try and hit DC. Flip it. Flip it. Is Play Greninja the worst thing that will happen to Zen for any of you? I think I genuinely probably will play Greninja in the cup day too. Like. Because it probably will be the last opportunity I get. And then I'll never have to play it again. Have to? It's not that you never have to. You're choosing to play it one more time. <laughs> Okay, then I'll never be allowed to play Greninja again. There you standard. go, you disgusting, disgusting human. <laughs> you need to join the Church of God. You disgust me. Talk to Kirk and we'd love to coach you on Zoro Pixies. I've got two very good coaches for Zoro Pixies. Okay, this... this I, I won a game against Buzzwall, but he did nothing. Interesting. I think Rab will have a spicy quad hooper list for you. You say you don't want to think. I do want to think. I want to get better. I can't get better by... Come on! Playing... <laughs> yes, poggers! Sorry. Carry on. <laughs> you were saying? I'm behind on the stream, so I'm... <laughs> oh, God. Okay, you got it. Well done, friend. We don't want to initiate the beast ring just yet, because he has choice band. So we'll hit this guy. Genius. Initiate the beast ring. Initiate. Maybe we should end the season how you started it, for, Tom, for Time of Awful Lotto. Oh. Good idea, Twitch happy face. Trainer Chip. Hey, Trainer Chip. How's it going, dude? Oh, I was talking about I'm playing against him. Oh. Well then. If you're here as well, hello. Hey, friend. GLHF. What's he GL. playing? Uh, uh, beware sleeves so far. Oh. He knows. He knows the I think I see. Video, I see. Kartana kicking things off. Hello. Okay. Let's keep that on the board rather than slicing off my energy. Thank you very much. Slice. Bridget Zorogarb, maybe? I would assume Zorogarb. He's Bridgeting turn one with a Kartana in the active, so. <gasps> oh. Oh. <laughs> That's not a rubbish. What's he gone and done here? That's a counter energy. Hello. See, <laughs> <are> you, <mate? laughs> yeah. This is Zoro Mismachius, Joe. He's done you again. Good Zorro luck. Zoro 
think he is. Uh, why is he sycamoring? Why is he? Why is he getting the? I don't understand. Explain. What do you do? Put another yeah. lele down for a supporter. Yeah. Playing around parallel turn one, I guess. What are you playing? Zoro, I guess. Then yeah. Makes sense. Can't bridge it, but that's fine. All I need is one Pokemon. Oh, I, I hit the parallel as well. He's a genius. Well, where are my six prizes coming from this game? And can I parallel away two Lele's without being punished? Ideally, we get N here. Poggers. I really want an attachment this turn, but I just want to get that other puzzle back. It's a good card. Realistically, though, we've only played one Guzma. I think we can get away with it. Valuing an attachment this turn over a puzzle. Hmm. I think we got to get the attachment in. And I think it should be the Galisopod. Because if he's KOing the Zoroark with anything, it'll be an Ultra. And then we need to armor press on that guy. And that's the that's the line we'll stick to. Ugh, Joe. What? I have to <laughs> I have to dangerous rogue a Miss Magius if it becomes active next turn. Deal with a threat, yeah. <laughs> oh. I oh. see. <laughs> See how kind these three cards are to them. You are technically looking down the barrel, and they did technically get an Ultra Ball. Wait, did they just get rid of a letter with that Ultra Ball? I must have seen that wrong. <laughs> Wait. No, surely not. Ah, uh, Doomsday. You're right. DC is better than the grass. Mm. Mm. Now the grass is still fine. Like, I wouldn't attach just a DC to the pod because we still don't... Oh, really? Beetle. That's in counter energy, maybe I should have played around shaming. What a shoes that is. Oh, don't go for an extra step. You big, big clown. Uh, this has a much worse ultra squids than rock. Much worse ultra squids than rock. I always find myself needing, literally needing end to stick against ultra squids playing pod. That's a big concern. Big, big concern. We're not getting shamed, we are getting Miss Maggiest. Oh dear, oh dear. Not the frog sleeves. Anything but the frog sleeves. Also got the squirtle sleeves. Okay, it's the other. It's the other. The other frog. It's the brain frog. Brain freeze. Looking 
people to the culture shop once rotation goes around. It feels like it's a big rotation. Looking forward to it. It kind of always does, but this is a big one. <laughs> Every damn time. <laughs> Zoro You're right there. five. Cheers for the cheer once again. You're right there. This is a this is a big rotation. I think. I think it's a very important and very good rotation as well. Can we keep Bridget think... though? We'll reap the reward. <laughs> My god, Rock is a busted deck. Change my mind. Wait a minute, Joe, what? This is the what? This isn't Zorua's. Oh, I feel sick. Something's not right here. <sighs> Let's hope he doesn't have two Frogadiers this turn, I guess, and a Switch card. It's also a Switch card, I guess, technically. Okay, okay. We can get him. Let's get him. Quick. Get him. Hmm. I don't know how to do this. He knocks me out. That's fine. get the camera no <laughs> match made in heaven Jack is that your phone beetling it's not my phone literally has to be my phone is not within range to be, I believe. He's lying. <laughs> Unit energies. Frosty Mocker 999. You frosty little mocker. Welcome to the team. So we have a Guzma. We also have a timer ball. Ah. If we're quick double heads. <laughs> oh yes, yeah, so we actually hit it. Boggers. We can't get a knockout here, but we can indeed knock out this Miss Magius at base. Waiting for it. As long as we find an energy. Oh, Poggers. What is Jack on about? I don't know, man. I'm trying to work out how to deal with a Miss, uh, Miss Magius. Is what I'm on about. It has weakness. That's a good start. Dead. 
you bad kid. Pog pog, goodbye frog hey. frog. We have a Kirkuminator. Oh yeah? Joining us. Big Kirkuminator. Bring him in. Bring him into the fold. Bring him into the origami. Sorry, Latios frogs. Winning a game with Buzzwall. What? Hello. All right. Hello. How's it going? I'm giving Buzzwall a second chance after Monday. I'm playing oh, Brown Greninja. Yeah. Oh. I don't believe it. Chaos Wheel. I can't deal with that this turn. I can only deal with it last turn. Chaos Wheel. What are you playing? I'm sorry, Miss Maggie. Oh, you Lord. know, bad deck. Well, these these DCEs are useless now. Thanks, Chip. That deck. That's a deck. It did only do ten damage to his Zoroark, though. So. Hmm. Do I play Regirock X? No. So, from what I saw in that last game, you weren't playing Buzzrock. You were playing straight like a Rock, rock. I mean, it is Latios Frogs, so... It's the plan. Can you blame me? No, I'll let you off. You should. Well, it's an EX Pokemon, and that ruins your Sledgehammer schemes. So it's a card that you have to put down in the late game, but that's pretty much always the bench spot of a Buzzwall GX. Cool. Yeah. Probably funny start testing for Valencia. No. Is it that time? I'll turn one in. You don't see that very often anymore, do you? What is Zoropog? It's uh, Zoropod, but Poggers. <laughs> With added poggers. I really don't want to end his hand, so we'll sack one of our two B strings that we play. <laughs> 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 and we've prized the other one. <laughs> what did I tell you, Joe? What? Why are you playing two? I'm playing four elixir. Right. Dream, what did you tell me, Jack? This is going to end well. Oh, do not play it too, friend. You lie. I will. Don't you ever lie to these people? Ever. I'll, I'll post screenshots of the chat in Discord. Don't you make me do it. <laughs> Oh, you won. Well done. Every time I restart PCCGO, the first deck I see is Archie's Choice. If only. If only. How does this deck deal with Zygarde? When is Valencia? Uh, we travel a week yesterday, but the tournament's not oh, until a week yeah. on Friday. Oh dear. Oh, I Plenty of time Friday. for testing. Yeah, it's Friday, Saturday rather than Saturday, Sunday. If England win, what day will be the semi final? Uh, it's like Wednesday, Thursday, right? Oh, yes. When England win. <laughs> Have you seen our record against Sweden? It's so bad. Mm -hmm. So very bad. Pog -pog. I'll never beat Sweden. Pog -pog. You don't need choice bands in this matchup, right? Get out of here. 
This is how little I trust the draws of this deck. You going double double octo? No, choice banding a Remoraid pre Cynthia. Oh. <laughs> oh. I just have no no time for this deck. Okay, so they're likely if we put down a Rockruff, their three card hand has to be Guzma strong to deal with our Rockruff, so let's just try and develop it this turn. They could also have Sushi Master and get it, but so I think it makes but... sense. <clears throat> You sound very echoey tonight, Joe. If I attach another energy here, he can... Are you actually just... in the bathroom? No. <laughs> hmm. Thinking pose. Thinking thoughts. Three, four, five, six, seven. The one thing I did massively wrong on Monday was where I attached to my dudes. So I'm really thinking hard about where I attach to my dudes this game, or these next few games. Because looking back from Monday's stream, I think I misplayed almost every turn with my attachments, which is great. I mean, I know I was drawing terribly, but it made my decisions worse, basically. Okay, no Guzma, feels good. You're alive. Oh, now. Oh, deck. <laughs> What's going on? I've had to use three of my puzzles on turn two. That doesn't sound good. That's good, isn't it? Just to get a knockout on a baby buzz wall. Mm. There's fear in your eyes, young Harry. <laughs> I can't even... Uh, I can't even trade this to... This is awful. I don't like Zara Art. There's too many decisions, I'm telling you. It's not good for your mental health. How do I deal with a lichen rock? See, then there's a lichen rock coming down. That is mental. Oh no. Oh dear. Right, because the format's gone more so what focused again. Has it? Compared to recent times. What about turbo metals again? How about no? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was rude. The Turbo Metals isn't a deck. It is. You said it yourself, Luke. It's four attachments compared to Buzzwall's one, essentially. It takes us P strings. Let's find an alternate metal attack real quick. Oh, you got the new baby dust made to prod things. When are we getting those before Valencia? Oh, you've oh, got mine. I've got mine. Oh, how many did you get? Two. Oh, great. There's many hours. All stocked up, don't you worry. What happened to your spice you were talking about the other day? I feel like the list is too hard to make and I haven't got time to test. Oh, wait, I have them off from work tomorrow. Oh, yes. Talking to himself? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. It's worth it. Oh, I'll just flatten a packet of crisps. My captain knows knows where it's at. That's because he's at the church of Mark and Garbador. Don't Mark, make God, me attach an energy to this clown. We should GX this turn, right? Oh, but he's still at four prizes. I really want to cash in on Sledgehammer. Why is Diancy prized, yo? Sadness. 
If you played that red, you rock. <laughs> uh, awkward. It's just bad, though. Like, you're only playing one Buzz or GX for a reason. Disagree? Oh, no, I, I think one Buzz or GX is fine. Yeah. I'll just start testing towards the end. If they were just making attack non GXs, it would be busted. <laughs> Oh good, our turn completely depends on a time ball flip again. Oh, they play what? two buzzes. Uh oh, B-string turn could destroy us here. <clears throat> yep, double tails. I'm taking time balls out of this list. That is a correct decision. Correct decision. Don't know what I just said. Making words up. I messed up. I forgot that on my B string turn, like on the. Oh no, we didn't have any B strings in deck. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We can't go digging for cards we don't have. We can just say we got unlucky. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. It actually feels like everyone in the world is a better Buzz Rock player than I am. I just don't know what the right decisions are each turn. Die, die, die. I mean, maybe Diancy being prized is the problem that turn. That is huge. If my, yeah. Like, otherwise I have to spend the second attachment here. Lycanroc doesn't want an attachment on the bench. Uh, I don't know, though. He still has a potential Lycanroc of his own to come out to gust up, to gust up anyway, so I felt like cashing in on it. Too many decisions. Too many bloody decisions. still have our super odd and we still have two elixirs so the idea is going to be to burst out elixirs onto the buzz wall so we should not put this out yeah we should because he's always taking a prize next turn <laughs> yeah we should so we need to burst our buzz wall out next turn to win basically Bust him out, out of nowhere. I perhaps should have gone for the Remoraid over the Rock Ruff there. Okay. I think it's actually better for him to risk flips here than uh, promoting this. But I don't know. Okay, we can win. We can win. We can be done. Just gotta burst the big boy. Big boy. Where are you? We have three elixirs in this deck of 18 cards. And we have a super odd that we could also hit. Let's burst! Da 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 da. What elixir and all our basic energy, of course! Ha ha! Kill me. <laughs> <sighs> oh my god, that hand. <laughs> <laughs> and you miss the elixir. <laughs> <laughs> that is tragic. Oh dear. Oh lord. <laughs> hmm. Oh dear. Why did I say that we could win? <laughs> that did not go to plan. Mm, 
Good news, they let a buzz GX, everyone. Kenzus is now hosting. Cheers so much. Cheers for the host. Please. Oh dear. Thank you. Yeah, it is kind of theme decky, but you're right that some people are better at playing, at playing it than others. But it's also like, oftentimes, it's best just to not. It's so weird. It's so counterproductive at times, where you're like, I should play this card now statistically, but it depends what pops out of this, that, or the other, and if my elixir hits. And it like right now, it's like I should be ultra balling three elixir here. But I'm just dead, right, if I don't elixir right now. It's like if the first elixir misses, do I put down the other rock craft? There's so much weird stuff. Like if I'm putting down the rock craft, am I playing any elixir here? Am I ultra balling away, ultra ball rock craft, and then getting remoraid so I can ultra ball next turn and have a guaranteed artillery? It's not even guaranteed if you can goosmer it out. Or am I just saying, you know what, I don't have a hand for the next three turns, and I'm going to try and get Life and Rock next turn. Like, what do you even do here? God damn. That sounds like a bad comment. This deck is, like... So weird. So weird. You'd go for Remo. Yeah, I see, see, Dave. I think I don't know. I think I'd go for a Lele here. It's we don't play Lele. Uh, what? Doesn't play Lele. Theme deck version. Doesn't play Lele. Which is Tours list didn't play it. Zero Lele. Not even one. That is wild. Why? I think I'd go for a Lele here. <laughs> That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Hmm. <laughs> you know what? You solved the puzzle. I was, over I was overreacting. Scoop him up. I am now. I can ultra space and buzz walls, that's true. Sad violin. I mean, I don't over-exaggerate with the fact that I brick every game with this deck. I was Today was meant to be the redemption stream where I played better with this deck. But it turns out I've just drawn worse. Ah, I know that feeling. That wasn't part of the... Redemption. That wasn't part of the... Oh, yeah. Didn't have Guzma lot the turn I didn't go for it and then does the well, what are you doing? What have you done here? <laughs> what have you done? Well, what have you done? Not what are you doing? 
That is literally the worst target he could have gone for. It's the one thing we didn't want yeah. to happen. <laughs> <laughs> what? That is that is poggers. <laughs> I just don't understand. Redemption, you say? Redemption stream. It's back on, boys. <laughs> <laughs> We're back in business. Oh, more energy. We're back in the game. Guarantee GX or get out the sushi. I say sushi. Sushi. This is where he misses GX, right? Of course. Um, fudge. <coughs> Do, do. Surprise tackle. Do. Surprise tickle. They have B strings next turn. Hooper? Oh my god, this man just hoopered. Hooper? Like Scoundrel Ring Mega Guardy Hooper. Hooper. He just got two Regirocks and a Zygarde. He has four EX Pokemon in his deck. My Rock Ruff's dead. Dead. Oh, oh dear. No. You've been had. I have been had. Hooper. Guys, That's such a good card. I had an idea. Yeah, we actually <laughs> took a big risk there, Tech Q. You're, you're right. <laughs> but I don't think we, I don't think we win if we don't do this. Also, it's actually really debatable that I should have just gusted this up and killed it rather than killing the Naganadel because I'm not scared of Naganadel getting B stringed. I am scared of this getting B stringed. So, I possibly should have just killed this. Booty switch never punished. Oh, I was punished. Watching Joe play Buzzrock. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the stream could end at any moment. What's a mid-range metal attack here? Christ <laughs> sake. <laughs> Shut up, Luke. What can deal with? Just needs a mid-range attack. Baby birth. Nothing. That's the point of baby birth. It's broken. Nothing can deal with this monster. Genesect. <sighs> Monster Zinc. Genesect and Adelmise. S get life. Cheers for the sub, dude. Oh dear, the things that I was worried about happened. But regardless, he could have got another one out anyway, so. Heatran, you say? No, no one said Heatran, Luke. Discard two energy, that is. Just... Yeah, tech you. I mean, I'm actually like the biggest serial offender of doing that when I'm watching other people stream. <laughs> people play so badly on stream. And I'm the worst one for calling people out as well, so... Uh, it's fine. Okay. Here's the plan. Get out our Buzzwell. End to four cards and hit our one beast ring. And then he doesn't get an energy off of the end. How's that sound? Poggers, let's go. So, oh, yeah. so foolproof plan. I literally hate you. You know, we probably should play an extra B string thinking about it. Oh, really, Joe? What What are the chances? What are the chances? I mean, I'm just, just thinking about the logistics of it all. Oh, yeah. We probably should play it. Should we? <laughs> God's sake. Jack, 
I should make that change back from what I said, back to three B string. <clears throat> yeah, you should. I don't know it's why. If, I don't know why you told me to play two. If I'm honest, it's as if I have actually already had this conversation. You know what I've just realised, Jack. This week. Do you know what I've just realised? He's at two prizes, isn't he? See you later, mate. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. I just can't play this deck. It's just a stone wall okay, fact. I go, need to so just listen. move on with my life. Yes, yes, move on. We have one week until Valencia. You know you're playing Zoroark. Play Zoroark. I knew I was never playing Bosrock, but I'm actually just incensed at how bad it is. But it turns out it's just me. My so, God, I need so to stop. watch. I need to watch people play this deck because it is a it is a joke how how poorly that goes every game. It never feels in my control. And oh, I need to change this. Oh, you and... nearly deleted Zoropod. That would <laughs> that would have been the icing on the cake. <laughs> so angry, I'm deleting my favourite deck. Just don't play Malamark. There is no way Joe isn't playing Zoroark. He's done it once. I think he felt physically sick. There's no way. There's there's just no way. It's just nothing. Wait, I've already cut to three Guzma in this deck. Hello. Why have I done this? That's the greed. That's the greed cut right there. Okay. Ah, I gotta play four goos. Let's play. How about no field blower in this deck? <laughs> Stop getting so close to the mic. <laughs> oh my god. It's like the inner thoughts. Like, like, leave. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah. Do I have a YouTube channel? Yes. Me and Jack uh, have the Omnipoke YouTube channel. Omnipoke. Psychic. Man, you know how many times people tell you to do that and it might be the right decision? I should try weakness policy. Yeah, we'll just do this for now. It's gonna go wrong and you're gonna get mad. Why are you playing Malamar? This isn't Zoroark! Oh my god, Joe, you Fine. don't Fine! Leave me alone, Jack. You don't know what I've been through. I do know what I've been th you've been through. That's what I'm telling you to... I can't deal with you in the heat getting angry. I can barely deal with you in the cold being calm. Mm -hmm. so let's just... <laughs> I'm going to put four Zoroars and four Zoroark in your hands and lock you in your room. Why am I playing Greninja? I do think before the before the rotation, Joe, you do need to have a stream of Greninja. I do think that is that is one hundred percent something that needs to happen. I do hate myself enough to play Greninja at the moment. Exactly. <laughs> Precisely, some would say. Don't do it. No, of course not. No, of course not. You silly Luke. Don't be daft. But you know we're talking about decks having a certain amount of cards built for energy at the moment. Yes. Yes, this has 22. Maybe that's too many. What are you thinking of building? <laughs> what are, you, you two are... I'm, I need new friends. <laughs> 22. Joe's actively playing decks he knows he's not going to play. And, Joe's, and Luke's considering... 22 cards devoted to energy, whilst complaining that decks currently have 16. 22 card pickup. <laughs> I'm so mad. Oh my god, and because I'm so mad, I've just thrown the game! Oh lord, that's it not, happened. That's not why. Oh, right, well now I've got a mallow for different targets. I just want to play clown. Oh, <laughs> is parallel gone? <laughs> what? Of course, Parallel's not god. Can I, can I ban it for one tournament? Can <laughs> I ban it? I can play Xerneas. You're an idiot. I might just play Xerneas anyway, at this point. Why would I play bad, sad music when Greninja's going day before rotation? That is a parte right there. Yeah. We'll have a disco. Joe, yeah. have you been wearing that same t-shirt for like three weeks straight? No. Every stream, I swear, you're wearing that T-shirt. Yeah, but I mean, it could just be my Wednesday shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Wednesday socks. 
Oh, double tails and tying the ball. I'm actually taking them out. I'm actually taking them out. He's just puzzled back a timer ball. You sh no. Oh. <sighs> I think it's double tails again. Hopefully this DC makes him want yeah, to got double heads. Uh, uh, Not anymore. <laughs> it is Wednesday. When's the Celestial Storm review coming out? We're recording it tomorrow. So much thinking. Uh, the t-shirt doesn't say bum. It says rum. And actually says rum ham. I've said this so many times. <laughs> <laughs> it's a. Uh, it's always sunny in Philadelphia reference. Oh my god. <gasps> you greedy mother. Yes. Get it. Fight him. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Greedy mother. Get him. You greedy mother, get him. <laughs> yes, <laughs> get him. Get him now. Greedy mother. Go get him. Not quite the bench shirt. You're not wrong. You're not <laughs> wrong. <laughs> You're on the bench. Us doing 30 here means nothing. So we should save this for Zoroark slash next turn's pod. Does it? Image you can... Yeah. Cross and cut. Mm. Cross and cut KO. The lads raise a good point. But I've got rid of Mallow now. Huh. Huh. Good to know. Let's hit him for 30. It was actually wrong to evolve. It was right if I kept Mallow. It was wrong to do it now. You got rid of Mallow. You clown. Oh, I've got another timer ball, lads. It's all going to be all right. Is it hard to decide on something before this weekend? I mean, that's why we're, I'm testing a variety of stuff at the moment. Oh, it's all going to be okay, lads. Do you know why? Because we got lucky. You know, somehow, I'm not surprised. Don't believe it. It's a ruse. Oh, I definitely should have puzzled first, maybe. We hit double puzzle. We have to double puzzle for a timer ball again. <laughs> or do I, just ex do I just accept that I'm not going to win this turn? Oh, he scooped. Ha! <laughs> ah, uh, yes. We're still streaking. It's fine. <laughs> People scooping when we don't have the win. Easy. Easy clap. Easy clap. I don't know what would have to win to make to shake things up hugely, though. I don't know. Nothing. Something, something deep in the depths. Of I'm not going. Brain. Sorry. Nah, who's Todd? I mean, two of the three internats he played, he essentially won with Rogue, because it was like the first time the deck appeared, basically. So. Yeah.
He's the rogue clown. <laughs> Did I just give up on Buzzrock? Yeah, I suck with it. Yeah. <clears throat> I can't even discredit the deck anymore because I actually just suck with it. Like, the, <laughs> I was saying lines in my head that just na made no sense in any realm, so. Any <laughs> realm? Not any world, not any land, any realm. There are no realms of possibility. This is right. Oh, I'm against Buzzrock guy again. Wait, no. Is this Buzzrock guy or is this Hooper guy? No, no. Oh, this might be Hooper guy. This might be Hooper for Zygarde, Reggie Rock, Reggie Rock guy. Oh, no. That gives him about 14 more outs for turn one knockout on a Rock Ruff. Are you going to win within finals, my captain? That's pretty cool. That's actually amazing. I think he may not be going, he may just be watching. It's super hard to get tickets. Watching the Nuzlocke like and Nuzlocke Joe Cyber Shop at times, what is that? Um, honestly, because... I'm not 100% familiar with the software yet, so it could be something kind of like, okay, that's not why, but it's probably me out of me doing something wrong rather than me knowing what the issue is, mm -hmm. because I'm not fully confident with the software yet. This is this the whole project, whilst being a um, something new for the channel, is also a really really big test for me because I've learned like four different programs that I've never learned before just for the series. So, uh, I guess that's my get out clause of expect teasing problem, teething problems. Yeah. Um, my but I learned right though. Potato yes. PC. It looks. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it is that, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, I and learned. The fact it lives in the middle of nowhere. I learned photo. It's saying this place is all right though. The rest, like my actual house, is the house is awful, but the cottage is fine, right? Yeah. Um. But yeah, I learned Photoshop and Sony Vegas in the space of a day of each, like for each. So I'm still really, really adjusting to using them. And like even now, I haven't used either of them for like three or four days and feel really like I've got to do a little bit tomorrow and feel really nervous about doing it again because it got to a point where I was producing like four or five videos a day for like a week maybe. And I was just in a pan and it was really, I could like edit chop it and get a video ready to render in half an hour and I know it's easily going to take double that tomorrow when I start again but you know I'm glad I've learned them they're really really it's been really really interesting I know like now just watching YouTube videos how people do some of the stuff they do which is really cool you're like oh that's that's that button there that they've used to zoom in on someone's face <laughs> and stuff like that it's cool But yeah, TLDR, it's my ignorance with the software rather than Joe's bad footage, I believe. Uh, it sounds better when we blame, blame Joe. But yeah, we can blame Joe. I think it's Joe's fault. Same. I have no good turn three play. So I need to single puzzle. Oh, good timer ball. That's the one. Uh... Well, Ferramosa doesn't do a good amount of damage. Excuse me? I'm getting desperate. That's lied yourself. <laughs> <laughs> um, hmm. No puzzles used yet from our side. We do have an e-hammer, which we could play. 
We could redevelop parallel. Parallel. We could just hold them to be versatile. We've done everything we need to this turn, I think. So let's keep the versatility. Could use it for Ace of Rota, for example, next turn. Our mic volumes are a bit low. We get that sometimes. I mean, when we record, they look high. So it's one of those things that, where we don't want microphones popping and stuff. Yeah, if that is the case from... Now, like I know, I know a really easy fix for that, so I can start ramping the volume up a little bit in general. Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, that's perfectly easy to fix if that is. I don't want to say an issue, but you know what I mean. Yeah, if there's if that's something you would rather see. We've we did like because we're going away to Valencia and stuff like that. We've done a fair bit of recording already, so you might not notice it, might not notice it for a few weeks, but at least for this first series, this is what how we wanted to do it. So. Um, oh, brilliant! Double tails on time wall again. Broken. <sighs> this card is trash. It's actually trash. I don't get how Seb and Heady both won with two time wall in that list. I actually don't understand. Seb, are you still here? Adamantium Logan X. Cheers for the follow. Possibly the best name I've ever heard. Jethereal as well. <laughs> Jethereal. Cheers for the host as well. Poggers. Poggers. <laughs> right, so now I have to mallow for a supporter and not get it, ne not use it until next turn. That's good, isn't it? Actually, I should mallow for a Zoroark and a supporter, so then I get a Zoroark. No, not a Zoroark. No, right, I've decided I'm playing the deck I was talking to you guys about. <laughs> Oh, yes. You know where that list should go. Where? Straight in my basket. <laughs> <laughs> now pop it. It can be arranged. <laughs> it can be arranged. Oh, kill me. D Joe, did you see the message I sent to Luke after? About Zoroark? I don't know what we're talking about. Oh, what? you don't? No. What? What are you talking about? It's a deck I told you about, but you were, you were drunk when I spoke to you about it, actually. Blasphemy. Do you guys, do you guys have any plans on what other Nuzlocks you would like to be doing? Any of the randomised rules for Um, we... <laughs> so we may have got a little bit carried away. And had, I want to say, an hour-long chat about seven seasons worth of Nuzlocks. <laughs> Just a seven. But, oh my god, they're exciting. You've you've seen Nuzlocks, you've seen Wedlocks, you've seen Solely. All I'm saying is one of our locks has I think six prefixes. True. Six. Yes. <clears throat> yeah, that's a fair point, Sean. Don't really want to play this format again, but hey ho. I think I've had enough time now to not hate it. Yeah. I don't enjoy it, but I think I've had enough time to not hate it now. Yeah, I'm the same. I don't mind. I think it's going to be so sad. I, this is <laughs> this is when I want expanded cups. I was talking to Joe, or I was talking, I said on one of the UK groups the other day, I kind of had a massive rant about expanded cups. But if they were going to do a while of expanded cups, I think this would be a good time to do it. Because they can't legally sanction post-rotation tournaments, so why not have Expanded now, where Expanded's not going to change, or it might change, but we've done Standard, and we know for a fact Standard is changing, so yes, Expanded might also change, but also it might not, so why not run some Expanded tournaments anyway? Of course, the issue is UK or Europe may not be getting big Expanded tournaments, so then what's the appeal? But I think... This would be a good time for cups to capitalise and expanded tournaments because no one no one wants to play this format. No one does. So why not? I think I, I think this is this is when I'm most likely to want to go to expanded cups. Whether that will happen or not, I don't know. 
It depends whether what Max said earlier on is true and what Max say? He just said apparently um TPC I have said that uh as of Friday, no, Monday, I think, uh we're we're officially in the new season. So tournaments can be held under that label. Um I know, I know, my captain, but that's why I think now is the now is a good time to hold expanded cups because if if they do them all now, they don't have to do them when we have rotation and people are going to try hard again. I think they'll still get a good enough attendance from people like us who want the points and don't care about standard, but they can yeah, then also point. I think get a good sense. a good amount of attendance later on in the year, and they've filled their quota for all the people that are like, well, we want expanded cups. Blah, blah, blah. Well, you had your expanded cups in the two months around Worlds where people who weren't going to Worlds... I guess the argument is people are going to Worlds, but the Worlds competitors have the Anaheim Open or the Nashville Open. So, I don't know. That That's just... I had a massive rant on one of the UK groups about expanded cups the other day. Um... I feel really strongly about how cups should change. It's how interesting that we're almost in the new season, but we've not had any major announcements for that new season yet. They said um, when they announced uh, the Nashville Open that uh, the announcements would come at the end of July. So before Worlds, um, we know what the structure is. They said towards, I think they said third or fourth weekend. Which I, I would imagine it will be around a similar time that the ban the quarterly ban list is announced. And the more. Which again, I don't know whether they will do like I think they will do a quarterly ban list, but it'll be weird whether they if they're gonna make any changes to expand whether they do it now or whether they do it on rotation date. Cause there's two different dates. I don't know. Since not playing Pokemon, I've had a lot of time to think about Pokemon. I've, I've presented Joe with so many weird questions over the past two days. He's been like, Jack, I don't know. Just stop thinking. Let them do what they're going to do. But what if they do this, Joe? What if they what if they completely scrapped internets? How about that idea? About 3 a.m. in the morning. Joe wakes up to go to work asking me how late I've been up. Joe, I've had an idea. Yeah. Oh, dear. What if we sack in Worlds? What if we didn't have a World Championship? How about that one? Have I tried Zygarde Lycanroc? No. Um, I don't know. Even though there were a few results with it, the people piloting it were like, don't try this at home. And Zoropod's on the incline again. So the sort of appeal is fading already. Ah, oh, boys, we're in that situation again where we've got to, got to get ourselves at least one heads on a timer ball. I love that situation. <laughs> to me, sure. that sounds sure quite easy. Don't think. <clears throat> Let's see how this goes. Bed and breakfast. That's one tails. Do you That's bread two and tails. Butter, Luke? <laughs> no, bed and breakfast. <laughs> eat, eat, sleep, everything. Oh. No, you didn't go for the full cliche. Just everything. Yeah. <laughs> so I have to trade the four ending here. Neuven Garb. No Coco? Yeah, Zoropods have been cutting Coco. Just for... Just because the list is so tight. You could choose to play one Floatstone, one Coco, like the good old days, but... The problem is, you're trying to, when you're doing that thing, you're wimping out into Coco because the Coco is tanky and survives a hit. That ain't the case anymore. Also, it was cool to do a flying flip to get like 170 things in range, and now everything is like 190, so that's also like less good. Coco is OP. Monkers. I 
Magic the Gathering ad on a Pokemon thing. Not cool, Twitch. <laughs> I got double tails. Tech, you coming in with the. Who okay. you're running nine knowledge. energy? Is that too low? I've just had a Shane McMahon turn. And the smile widens every time. <laughs> oh, God. I'm about to fall off my chair. Happy 4th of July. Oh my poggers. That is unreal. That's almost worth a greetings, I tell you. Greetings. Oh, I haven't seen what the tavern brawl is today. Man, I haven't played Hearthstone in, like, months. No, I got my, I opened my chests today. My lunch break, that was about it. Mm. I played one game of Even Shaman and went on with my life. I've <laughs> only got. Just scooted on. I think about seven weeks until new set, I believe. Jeez. I got bored of it oh. so quickly, though, that I may... I'm probably just done with it now. Really? That's a shame. You're so close to, like, finishing everything. Yeah, true. Never give up. But I'm always, like I have been someone who's just like, okay, I'll buy all the packs now so I can play every deck. I guess now that I only have a couple of classes, I don't need to do that anymore. So. Yeah. It's a game, I don't know, it's a game I think I could get into if I had more time. Mm -hmm. But I just don't want to spend my time grinding Hearthstone. I realise that I'm not good enough at Pokemon to start not playing Pokemon. Yes, and that that's that's a big one. <laughs> that's that's a thing. Oh no. I've made a mistake. Ooh. What does it say on my shirt? It says rum. Ham. I think you need to stop wearing this shirt, Joe. Why? Yeah. The questions are coming in thick. People and fast. Can, people no, I don't mean that. I just mean you're going to have to ask the same question every single week. But it's my Wednesday shirt. Oh, poggers. Time a ball. Double tails again. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. Death is stupid. No, this card is stupid. The deck's fine. I'm so mad. Guess we just pop this down, don't we? Just say, you know what? I'm here. Deal with it. I'm here if you want me. <laughs> Like my list. Um, no, you've got nine energy in there, Luke. Rum ham. What's wrong with that? When you know, you know. That's what I'm saying. Rum ham. That's my best time to veto. You're getting. <laughs> Is his best play GXing this turn? Only if he has a Guzma. Yeah, okay. He has a Lily, so he has to not GX this turn. Parallel's good, though. Uh, buy me. We have puzzles in hand. And we have another Mew. Hooper, what are you doing? 
what are you going to do? You're not going to do anything. And that's a GXing me this turn. Which I don't advise, friend. Friend? Oh, it looks like that's exactly what you're doing. <laughs> it's only kind of done it. All right, let me look at your list real quick, Luke. Oh I'm my god. It. Luke, you've done the thing where you've tried to put too many different cards in this deck. Don't be silly. Joe Soul, there's a guru in it. True. I don't think you need three spreaders. Just add space. Honestly, no even in garbage. That'd be an up under item lock since turn two. Hammer's left right just doing nothing. It just is a terrible deck. Tell you what is a terrible deck. What's that? This deck with the timer balls. Is Seb on Facebook? I need to. I need to. I need to rant at him. Is he even in the chat anymore? No, he is not. Right, so they need to top deck end to have any hope of winning, right? No, isn't that, that's not true, actually. Isn't Hearthstone kind of like pay to win? It's actually cheaper than Pokemon, I think. I probably spend more on IRA Pokemon than I do on Hearthstone. And I can build like 80% of decks on Hearthstone. They have a really good reward system for like daily quests and stuff. It depends really what your barrier entry is going to be for Hearthstone. If you want to. It's just like in Pokemon. If you want to just build one deck in Pokemon or just one deck in Hearthstone, it's probably easier to build one deck in Pokemon. But. To have the full flurry of everything, it's probably easier to just do half stone. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Also, what a dust. Yeah, I've got like seven and a half K dust. I had seven and a half K dust going into Witchwood. I didn't spend any of it, and I still have seven and a half K dust ready for next expansion. You know, you know, fan then, Jack. I think I don't know how I would change it, but it isn't what I had in mind. Is it not? I'm gonna have to look at this now just to know what you guys are even talking about. Get <laughs> it on stream. I've been in the cool dark for too long. Cool, Luke out. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, it's this. Okay. What are you laughing at? I was, I was laughing at a picture of me <laughs> from a few years ago. Oh, yes. That I was sent by someone today. Oh, yes. What is going on? Oh, Luke, what is going on here? I think there's too much going on. There's let's, definitely too much going on. Straight let's strip up. it nah. back, Luke. Nah. Like, the list annoys me. I've never been annoyed at a list before. The list annoys me. It's good. It's good. How many games have we had with it? Quite a lot. So good, good win rate. Good What's luck. your win rate? 17-5 in 12 games.
He's 009 with it. Played 8 win 6. Are you going by it? Yeah, fair. Fair enough. Can't ask much more than that. No, 75% win rate. I scooped one of the games because I just, I just was tired the other night. I was like, I can't be bothered. You can have this, sir. Uh, probably not. <laughs> well then. <laughs> and the other game was against Bolt, so we would have won that if it was a different day. So basically, yeah. 8 0. Basically, yeah. No. Raichu Break Magneto. Can we just play something fun? That's what I'm trying to do. Keep shooting me down. No, I mean more fun than that. I mean timeless. I mean two turns of fun. I mean taking a whole extra turn of fun. Whoever drafted Mark for the NIC, some risky things are happening. Oh, God. Do you see what he said in chat today, Joe? I don't know what he's playing, no. You see what he sent the picture? No. Did you not? Uh, oh yeah. It's a deck that I've spoken. Oh to no, about. I did, I did, I did. A long time ago. <laughs> Poggers. I don't know how he's gonna fit stuff in, but it sounds fun. <laughs> he's got to fit about eight cards in that already sixty card deck, and yeah. I, just, I saw exactly zero cuts. Let me have a look. Let me have another look. Anyone else miss Nats? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Definitely. I wasn't, I wasn't like, <clears throat> Nats were sort of too, they left too soon for me because I never really had a good Nats run because I was still bad. Oh, Nats were good. That last Nats was so good. Tamal winning, me and you top 16ing Luke. That was terrible. It was great. I hadn't played all season. I got 250 points in two days. It was broken. <laughs> that is broken. Won a regional the next day. Played Trevenant to beat all the Night March. And your oh, two losses. No, no. Night March. You're an idiot. Beat two Mega Sceptile though, didn't I? That's an auto loss. Mega Sceptile, what a clown. Sean, I think you might have been baited. I think, I think, I, d I mean, I don't know for sure. I think Mark doesn't know what he's playing yet. But Benji's statement earlier on about 100% knowing what Mark was going to play, I think is... Why do the mark? Not correct. I think there's another deck in the works. It involves pink stuff. Maybe Mark's baiting us all and he's just playing Buzzgar the game. Probably. Why would he bait everyone who's not going to, <laughs> to the tournament? <laughs> Got you guys under my thumb. Yeah, Sean, it's... It's spicier than pink stuff. I'm playing Mega... I'm playing Guardi GX with Elixirs. What is this? What's wrong with Zoro Gardi right now? Hmm. Now, here's a better question. What's wrong with Zoro Galead right now? Nectar. Mark's considering Fairy. He. I really enjoy making He's buttons. not considering Fairy. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know well, Mark? Think... Have you ever met him before? I, I actually think. It depends. I think he's on about three different levels of clown. He either wants to play Buzzgarb levels of clown and do well, play medium tier clown, or play high tier clown. And I think... Because I think he was considering fairies. But I think they're middle tier clown. I think he's found a clownier option. I think he's meeting up with Todd this week, and he'll play something very good at the end of this week. Ah. He's going to enjoy winning too much, you mean? Hmm. He's quite good at it. Got a knack. Mm, has it? Got a knack. 
turns out. We just have the safe option. Yeah. I think some of the top 22 might play Mega Guardi EX with Dark Ride GX Energy Switch. Oh. Huh? Give me this list, Tech Q. I saw, uh, I saw Azul play a couple of games with it. Did he now? He, he had all sorts in there, man. He was playing Choice Band and the Magina to switch tools. Yeah, he was. Of yeah, course, he was. Of course he played. Why wouldn't Someone he? Someone send me this list. <laughs> I need he this. Sold. He is I need this in my life. Completely. Get in my life. I should have played Mega Guardian Sheffield. Still time, Jack. That's the one last ride we need to be building. Oh, um, Joe, Forget please. Forget Frogs. Please. One please. last ride. I'm please. 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 <laughs> Do it. Only if you play three orangaroos with me. I can I can be on board. I can I'm playing Mega Guardi. Help. You can use I know you can use Super EX. I built it. I still have it built. <laughs> oh too much order pad around. They are enjoying the coin flip. You've heard one of the Germans might be on the Mega Guardi bandwagon. Oh my this is, god. This is... <laughs> what's happening? Right. <laughs> you don't know excitement until you're here. Until Jack's you've given me right now. a full three Mega Guardi line. Jack is panting like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so ready. I don't know about this track. Jack, this takes busted, don't you? It doesn't beat Mega Guardi, mate. That's all I'm saying. It does. Trust me. Got that matchup sus. And evolve to heal the poison. Broken. Look at that. Confuse him if you don't kill him. Yeah. They'll definitely be confused. That's a fact. How do we beat Zoroark? That was all. Our, that was always our issue. How do we beat Zoroark? It's How just, many cards? It just hopes the Cartana spam, yeah. And why is it? Cool? Basically, what we could do is play like max potions as well. <laughs> and against Zoroark, we could just become a whale lord that just spams Cartana each turn. So, what we've got to do, Joe, is we've got to sit next to each other and we've got to have two 60 card decks that make up a 120 card deck <laughs> and just kind of use each other's resources. Correct. I'm taking a wild guess. I know I can put a bit of this on Discord if you want. Yes, yes, do it. I'm in. I'm in. I'm, I am so involved. I was going to get my invite before uh, Christmas. I'm not anymore. <laughs> but I am going to play Mega Guardi. <laughs> and he could not be more happy about it. I'm beyond excited, to be honest. Cut energy, it's recycled with Dragonite. Yeah, yeah, you can. In a country in the middle of the sea on the other side of the world. You know what? I'm not going to discriminate. I'm against a Lowland Dog Trio. It's all going off tonight. That beats Mega Guardi. So do we. Do we overtake? Do we, do we over meta game? What, well, Tet for Mirror? It's popping a 1 1 Alolan Doug Trio line and a single metal energy. Pop! We've all played it on stream, check his bots. Yeah, yeah. I, I saw him playing it on stream. I he don't. Had, I'm telling you, he had all sorts in there. I don't think you realise how excited I am. The word shenanigans comes to mind. When you're back from Valencia, <laughs> you need to have a chat about next summer Pokemon plans. Yeah, of course, mate. It can be before... Uh, I'm super busy before. Yeah, after works. We do need to chat about things, though. Uh... 
Okay, his last stream was an NAIC draft. That's Garbador. Ugh. Boo. More clown. More clown. Please, Joe. Re oh, you're definitely baiting me. There's no way you're playing this. Why not? I don't believe you. <laughs> I, loved it. That... I loved it as much as you, man. <clears throat> I we, were, we were the bros. We... we lived and died by that. Broke out the Mega Gardy. Mostly died. Um... Yeah. <laughs> Nah, we. I think it's both of our best ever finishes, right? Yeah. Mega Gardy. Oh, that's embarrassing. Broken deck. Just play Bulu. Do you even know me? That's Joe's favourite deck. He always says, well, it cups for that, so he might as well. It's giving me old one, two. Okay, I can't find it on Rahul, but let's head to Azul's. <laughs> I will find you! I don't need sleep. I need Mega Gardy. Fairy Brothers. <gasps> Is that it? Is it me you're looking for? No, uh, not it. Wait. This is more Zoro. Choice bands and B strings in Psychic Mally. He hasn't streamed for ages. He hasn't streamed for like two weeks. He's off this the is... grid. He's got the secret spice. This is for Mexico. <laughs> All these decks are trash. Alright, I'm hoping someone in CCG has a contact. <laughs> They're gonna hate me. I was saying how try hard I wanted to be this year. I'm now gonna be asking them for a Mega Guardy list. Guys, forget what I said this morning. Remember that Guardy list we were always talking about? <laughs> Do you have Max Rarity Mega Guard well, I know Jamal does, I'm buying them this weekend. Guaranteed. Max rarity. No. Even no. see. You suggest asking a Schultz? Oh, the Schultzes don't like me. What? <laughs> That's completely out of nowhere. Oh, Why would good. they not like you? I mean, I can't blame them, but... Embarrassing. I don't like you. <laughs> <laughs> don't put uh... this on them. What would you play oh, for NAIC? Yeah. I'm clicking other variant in in a Facebook poll because apparently Mega Guard isn't one of the variants. Don't know oh, why. Oh, what? That's not being funny. Well, they're all sleeping on it. Where's the shame concede? That's the question we're all asking right now. Where's the realisation that they don't actually play in case and this this is just like I don't even what? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? I tried to think of words but they just couldn't come out. This is, you know, that deck that's, that plays all the psychic stuff but without the squids. Turbo Psychic. Oh, oh yeah. Kakui as well, by the way. If you guys spotted that one. Who else do I trust that could have been playing it? No one. Because no one was playing it. I trust very few people on. Jack, am I building it after this game? No. Why not? I mean, you can try, but I don't think... I don't think you can. <laughs> I don't think you have the mental capacity to build such a good deck. <laughs> no, I just... I I don't think it's ever a deck we can build without some kind of guidance. 
because we tried and it didn't work. I don't know. Maybe I'm discrediting you, but... All I'm hearing is, yes, Joe, do it. <laughs> <laughs> do it now. And by saying those things, you've actually rolled me up enough that I have to do it, so... The... You think I wasn't doing that all along? He's reverse psychology, me. You were the psychology student. Jack, how, even... how does a 3-1 Mega Guardi line sound? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, God. That isn't what I wanted to do. I wanted to look at the list. Oh, this guy called a Suarez. Look at that. Do you know what? Instead of all this shenanigans, how yeah. about a card called Clawitzer? Oh, I feel so sick again. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> That is a card. Oh, Rahul, why are you playing such bad decks? Zoro Pod and Buzzwall. Of course, this goes in. Of course, of course. He's actually building it. Look at this. It already makes me feel so happy. <laughs> Didn't we decide? Oh, I don't know what we decided anymore, to be honest. Can we decide to never play this again? Oh, wait, yes. I'll go and have a look, Jack. Thank you so much. Yeah. What other when you play this card onto your bench cards should we play? Type it. I'll leave you. That's the round. Yes, but it's bad. This is the worst, isn't it? How many Lele are we playing and why is it four? Do it. Someone saying I'll call you? We got it, we got it, we got it. Nineteen Pokemon. That's fine. Get to discard them. More damage. More damage. Okay. Dark Rage Rise. Do we need to play two Dark Rise or one? I don't think we have space for more than one, if I'm honest. Okay. But two Dark Energy, right? Yeah. yeah. Seven Fairy? Do it. Mysterious treasure. If we're going out like this, then I might bust out Mega Sizzle. Well, oh, don't just course do that. You will. That's, just, that's just boring. <laughs> <God's sake>. <laughs> <laughs> I would actually be so mad. I would be so mad. Imagine if we if you caught like Schultz is playing Cardi with Sizzle. <laughs> 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 uh, oh my god! I couldn't it, just imagine that confusion. Just imagine. <laughs> I've, already, I've already played one once. Play Mega Scissor. So let me get my head around why they play Choice Band. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> it doesn't take much thinking. Damage. Damage. Oh. He needs to knock out Lele's friend. Yeah. New TCG, can someone let me know if it's paid to win? Um, It's one of the cheapest TCGs you can get into, but it is, you, like... You do have to front load a fair bit of... <gasps> Joe, I can't play this. Why not? I lost my fourth Lele, didn't I? This only plays three. Oh, yes! I was meant to lose that Lele. <laughs> Still not found it? No, I'm actually so uh... annoyed at myself. I really don't think I would have lent it out. Um, Because it's a Lele. But if I haven't lent it out, that means someone's taken it out of my binder. Which annoys me even more. Yeah, that's not nice. Wait, we don't need to bank up, do we? No. Um, no I'm going to buy a fourth. Conio owns three. Reese has said as soon as he owns one to sell, I've got first dibs on it. So I'm probably going to buy a fourth. And then if I find it again, I'll 
try and sell D. it. Dee Reese Williams. D. Reese Williams. My personal favourite Williams. Don't tell Luke. <laughs> I think they're both coming around this weekend. Oh, what? Um, <laughs> don't have a preference on Williams. <laughs> no, this needs blowers. Luke's normally lurking in the background of the chat as well, so he's going to be Yeah, sales. I know. <laughs> Either that or he's just going to ping me on Facebook in a minute. Diana, and also... Oh, boys. It's all bleeding, coming together. I have to go over at 60 plus up. Yeah. I've not even put the balloons in yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Said man. no one ever. Said me. <laughs> Today, it's not pay to win. Mega Guard is really cheap. <laughs> <laughs> oh Christ! Okay. Um... Sixty-two guards. The Nile sixty-two. I'm thinking of a weak link here. <laughs> Both factors poison infuse, so we have to evolve out of our own confusion. I don't think we'll ever have enough energy on the board to retreat out. No. no. And if we're going to be goosebring anyway, that doesn't make sense. So I think it's the weak link. To play any yeah. foes down. Two. We've got a let loose mark, that ogre. Yeah, we do. That's not the weak link, though, is it? Not the weak link, you say? I'll tell you what is a weak link. The fact that it doesn't have Skyfield and Jamin. Yes. Nearly get to search for. It doesn't matter because it doesn't do anything. <laughs> doesn't matter how easy it is to find it. it does nothing. Ultra space. Bit. Oh, she played one ultra space for the katana. The katana spam. Three guardy spirit links. That sounds greed. Three spam. Hmm. Three fine. You have a beginner. Plop them on anywhere. You, you can literally put them on anything. How do we get rid of parallel? Our oh, field blows, mate. Easy. <laughs> Is there anything that not... comes into play in discards? Nice. Stadiums. I don't think so. Parallel's not an issue because we knock out everything. But... <laughs> oh oh my turns. god. That's a genius. That's a genius name, Joe. Valencia boys. I'm, a... I'm actually sleeving this up now. IRL. <laughs> oh, Tech you just found the list as well. <laughs> <gasps> Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 97 fairy energy. One fairy. Hooper. Two Dark Grice. Oh, they've reeled you it back in a bit. <laughs> yeah, we only play nine energy, but we do have a lot of ball search, and that ball search can get us the Oricorio. If we're actually playing this, might as well play Order Pass. We have a lot of combo pieces. Wait, they play 40 Switch? It's changed a lot. Oh, they're playing Max Pots. Oh, okay, okay. We need, to we need to test that build. We've gone too techy, boys. We've gone over there. <laughs> <laughs> too many one ofs Oh, you're getting oh, Sylveon. How do we beat Sylveon? Sylveon all night. I've seen, oh, I saw him earlier today. I saw him about 6 p.m. He's still here. Just <sighs> waiting. You boring man. What's our answer to Hooper? He switched to Guru. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 no, no, wait, I don't know. Mm. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. We can, if we play Nihiligo again, we can GX with Darkrai. Free two prizes. 
okay, okay. 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 Let's get that back in there. <laughs> we're figuring out how the deck works. That's the fun of the... That's all. That's what we're trying to do here. Right, I can't yeah. attach active realistically, can I? Why are you still playing this game? What do you mean? This is an auto win. Is it? We can let loose his magical ribbon every turn. <laughs> yes, we can. He's lost. Let loose Guzma. See you later, mate. See you later, mate. Put it in standard format, chat. Jack, thank you very much. Plumeria. Off the end. Come on oh, now. With a low pump. <clears throat> We married away a plumeria. That's just not gravy, is it? Plays two parallel of their own. I don't like that. But this deck sounds greedy enough without <laughs> more greed. I want to save the let loose till now that I top dead this end. I want to save the let loose till we actually have a guardy up and rolling. <laughs> Wait, we play e switches. We can surprise him and put this active. Let's do active. Right. Do it. We play two e switches and two float stones. Re. Um. Active's fine. How many band are you playing? Two. They, okay, so this tech you sent doesn't play Magina band. So okay. his is more. His is, a, his is like tanky. Yeah. Glass is aggressive. Well, we'll uh, mm -hmm. I need to have a look at that list and see what's going on. <gasps> They've milled an e-switch. They've played around it. Oh, no. There's the hooper. Right, we'll just bear right off his bench. That's how it works, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, realistically though, they play Hooper. Good game. Okay, Jack, let me. Can you uh, tell me the differences then? Let's build their list. Keep our list built as well. Make make two lists. No, this is just terrible. Not terrible. It's... Jack. Mm. I mean, I will. I'm. 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 When are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. So three, three Guardi. Yeah. Three Lele. Yeah. One Hooper. One. Okay. One Oricorio. Yeah. Two Dark Rai. They're not playing. Wait, and two Dragon Rai? No. No Kartana? They, they got none of the cool stuff? No, no Guru? Well, our... that's happening. We need to keep our list built because we have the cool cards. Okay, carry on. Uh, two Parallel. No, okay, fine. Three Sycamore, three N. Yeah. Four Cynthia, four Guzma. Okay. One Lily. Triggered, but fine. Lily's probably good, actually. Oh, good. this list is from May. <sighs> okay. <laughs> okay, are you, are you ready? Are you ready Carry on. Uh, four Treasure, three Ball. Yeah. Four E Switch, four Spirit Link. Yeah. One rod, one blower. One two blower. Max, two max spot, two float stone. And then seven two split of energy. So 
So we'll go to second blower and guru over to parallel. So wait, you're saying it doesn't have the it's, it's, so this doesn't have the Nihiligo. It doesn't have not no no. I was just that was this was my Nihiligo comment was before seeing this list. I was just oh right Spit brainstorming. Forward. Yeah. Um, this also doesn't have Kartana and Dragonite, so we can't we actually don't have a way to beat Zora right now. Apart from mm. max potions. How many Ace of Rollers is our up there now? This needs another Super Rod if we're going to go the Max Potion route, though. Mm. Let's cut Cynthia. For another Rodney. Another Rod or another Energy? Another Rod. We need to shuffle in Pokemon to do damage. Do we? I think so, sometimes. Especially without Dragonite. But we're not doing any choice ban anyway, so we're just we're ha we're just two shotting everything. So we're just developing a board of Mega Guardies. Yeah, let's just play another physical energy. Okay. You can play one more game with this hate and It's going to go in the bin. This is playing. It's not going of, in the bin. It's playing a lot of supporters. I'm playing this deck. So. Playing. Whether you like it. Ten supporters plus seven balls plus three Lele. That is. <laughs> con con consistency. Hello. I actually want to play a second Hooper though. Let's cut to two Cynthia for the second Hooper. Hooper is just nectar. Do we need to play a third max pot to realistically beat Zoro? I think we lose to Zoro playing two recovery cards because they also have puzzles. Not recovery cards, Healy cards because they also have puzzles. Yeah. Do we need to play he had ball? parallels for Zoro Mark. Yeah, but. True. But I don't like the parallel route. I would, prefer, I would rather put a Katana in than a Parallel. I'd right. rather more Max Potions than Parallels. <laughs> hmm. I'm worried about... Makes me nervous, but we'll go that for third potion. So what's our big concern? Hmm. Let's try this. This sounds, this looks fun. This looks more fun than the last one. Because it's it looks, more fun than any deck in this format. It's even more yeah. combo orientated. <laughs> if there's one thing you like, four E switch. Hello. If we if we're playing ah, oh. if we're playing, do we ever put in the Nile Ego combo? We're playing so many cards to help with it. I've and been that really... sniped. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh God. Uh, if this is Sizzle, <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely you. Def oh my God, that was Metal Psychic. So yeah, Sizzle Garb one time. Oh God, we're gonna see a Mulligan. Oh, Fury Belts. It's not me either, I promise. No, it's uh, Max Madcap. Madcap. This is Metal Garb, right? Probably. I don't think it's Sizzle Garb, I think it's Metal Garb. He was talking to me about Metal Garb the other day. And what a perfect time to give it a go. Yeah. Oh, new expansion announcement is July 12th. For Hearth? For Hearthstone. Oh, that's, that's cool. That's Go way sooner than I thought. Yeah. It makes sense, though, because it it's early August usually, so that gives them a month to build it mm -hmm. up. Cool. If we top deck any ball such card, Hooper or Guardi, it's going to be a bonkers turn. So we've got 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11, like, yeah, 11, 12 outs. Oh, Guzma, what are you doing here? How we beat a Seller Stealer, Joe?
your desire. That's how. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Mm. What do we? Oh, against Ninja, we leave our board full, let them ping stuff twice, and then clear it. See you later, mate. <laughs> By the way, see you later, mate. <laughs> you love that now. You hated that saying. See you later, mate. No, you love it. You your your C is going for very long though. Yeah, that's the whole point. You're an extended seer. I prefer the short, sharp. See you later, mate. Well, that's it's it's one of those progressive things. Yeah. When so, you when you're a beginner to see you later, mate, you just casually throw it out there. Say it. You just say it. But when you're an expert in the field, after a while, it just has to become see you later, mate. <laughs> just gotta be. You gotta I'm get done. Dirty with it. Where's our cartana? <laughs> it's not in the deck. You can put it in there. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying, you know, we didn't think about Why? this matchup, did we? Why haven't we? I can only imagine people's ears after me. See you later, mate. <laughs> We've lost 25 years. <laughs> Feels bad, man. <laughs> Though genuinely, I do think we've lost viewers since starting playing this deck. Oh dear. But that's okay. This stream isn't for them. <laughs> this is for <laughs> us. I'm worried that we've already got rid of 2E switch and we haven't done anything with them. Fine, you've got two more. Plenty. <clears throat> they should definitely play Dragonite, by the way. Yeah. Great. Dragonite just means we can guarantee our supporter each turn. Like the one that we want. It doesn't make sense that this doesn't pay Dragonite. We need to make changes. Let's put Cartana back in and two Dragonites. Somewhere. Don't know where on earth these cuts are, but they're somewhere. It was created a while ago. Yeah. You can blast GX by trying to attack the Lele, so I guess we just concede. <laughs> <laughs> There's no point in me trying that. There's actually just no way. Hmm. <laughs> 20 past 11. Let's have... No, I don't want to play that deck. Let's have one more game of Zoropod and call it. Let's try and do my metal quest. <laughs> That's a snipe, for sure. Snipe me down. Done fairly reasonably with Sorry Pod today. We haven't seen as much Buzzwall on the ladder as I thought we would, though. Here's one. <laughs> oh, I played this guy earlier on. Do you want another spice, or are you He's tricking you with his Zygarde sleeves? Yeah, he did that. Did that to me. 
I was like, how do I win against Zygarde? It's fine. Started Buzzwell, didn't he? The old attached pass. That old chestnut. We've got the old Bridget pass. Oh no. It's the one thing we didn't want to happen. Another noise van deck, what is going on? Not one. Not two. What? Well, we need some things to go right here, don't we? Let's be honest. Just a little. Three, six, seven in hand. Don't really want to put them no, they're down there. Oh, fudge. Sorry, try and get a poke in this turn. Nectar. Get in there for a hundred. That's actually really good for us. This is how you meant to play Buzzwell. Let's hope his hand is so big that he has to do a dirty sycamore.
And now I'm super scared to play Zoro again because I lost it literally. Turn one, attached to Buzzwall. Turn two, attached to Buzzwall. <laughs> Turn three, attached to that Buzzwall. The dream is over. You know what wouldn't lose to that, Jay? Zoro Pixie Hammers. Don't be so sure. <sighs> Thinking he's done literally nothing impressive so far, and he's in such a commanding position. This could be an impressive turn, and then I just lose. Yeah, that's pretty impressive. That's me dead there. Yeah, yeah, that's me definitely dead. Oh dear. Just play uh, Buzz Rock. Do it. Lou, don't poke the bear. <laughs> it is quite ironic to see how bad people seem to draw with it when you play it and then you come up against someone and they just draw everything they want when they want. Every time. <clears throat> Ross has a new video for anyone wondering. Get that on real quick. New heat trend discards your own Pokemon deck really quickly. Is it allowed what he's just done to me? I need to check the Pokemon terms of use. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon terms of use. Uh, oh, defeated by turn one attach, turn two attach, turn three attach. God damn it. You know what this calls for. End of stream. No. I feel bad for ending every stream at half eleven now and not twelve, so let's open a pack to make up for it. Oh my god, I have loads of locked packs. This is unreal. Pack type. Have I not played Buzzrock? Look how good it is. I know, man, it's just not in my hands, unfortunately. It's been so rare that I've had a deck that I've not even been able to get close to grasping. Like, it's been years, I think. I mean, I've played decks better than others, but it's been rare that I've just been so, so far removed from, like, the thought process of a deck. It's really weird. Oh, poggers. I can't remember the last deck that I just genuinely could not physically play. I just couldn't wrap my head around it. Make a Mewtwo. Kept losing to uh, Totina. That was just sacky nonsense, though. Sacky nonsense. Plus, that was a deck I hadn't really tested at all. Right. 
Crates. Got some lunatones in here. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Fresh egg. Mate, I just don't know what to play. Mark has a hundred locked chests and doesn't open them. That's his mm -hmm. plunder. The one piece is in there. <clears throat> I mean, maybe he's just waiting until like an algorithm changes that makes them better. <laughs> or like a new set comes out and then you just open them. No, I think he just genuinely doesn't care. Yeah. Let's see how many he can get. Or as chat says, forever. he's the booty king. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. There we go. We've got no more booty to plunder, unfortunately. I'm low on packs, man. Oh, Zorowark, you get spanked by Buzzwall one game and you put the you scared the bejesus out of me all over again. Uh, oh. Damn it. Right, we'll just we'll just figure out what's uh what wins anyway, I see. Let's do that, shall we? Yes. I'm really hoping it's like a left field madman deck that puts the fear into Bosrock. Please <laughs> It's gotta be something out there. Hope, we can hopefully find no it. random Sylveons make it as well. That would also trigger me timbers. Oh, if so, there's so many there's so many potential jack decks. Coming back into this format. I'm not ready Let's for go. it. Let's go. No, I don't think I'll ever play Sylvia on the game. Okay, that'll be it for today, guys. Cheers. Good luck, anyone going to the NAIC. And yes. we'll be back Monday to talk about the results. So it should be good. Good indeed. Bye. See you in a bit, everyone.